Zebras are absolutely amazing and majestic creatures. They may look like horses or donkeys or even ponies, but what makes them so unique is their appearance. The iconic black and white stripes that surround their bodies sets them apart from all of the other mammals in the animal kingdom. That's why they look so amazing in real life. Some even say they look like referees. Or do referees look like zebras? <laughs> All kidding aside, today we'll talk about exactly why zebras have stripes and other things you didn't know about zebras. Did they inherit that from a magic stone in the woods? Were they really created with stripes? And what's the secret behind them? Hi. Welcome to my channel, where we talk about everything you want to know about all kinds of creatures. Be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell to stay tuned for more. Now, let's get started. Black and White – The Beauty of the Stripes So, why exactly do zebras have stripes in the first place? As it turns out, this question has been lurking around for years now, yet there is no scientific-backed answer. You might be disappointed, but there are some fascinating reasons and theories why these four-legged animals have their stripes. Believe it or not, scientists have proposed at least 18 reasons why our zebra friends have stripes. These range from warning colors to more imaginative hypotheses, such as distinct marks that aid in the identification of people, similar to a human fingerprint. Whatever the case may be, Zebras are definitely a unique and memorable animal. Additionally, striping patterns and intensity vary depending on the species and area. These striping variances, together with the environmental constraints, have shaped our understanding of how the stripes operate. While researchers continue to discuss the precise origins and purposes of zebra stripes, current research has concentrated on three possibilities – protection from biting flies, temperature regulation, and predator protection. Protection from biting flies It's well known that flies that bite can transmit and carry blood-related diseases to animals. Almost a century of evidence and experiments have demonstrated that flies have a tendency not to land on striped surfaces. However, the exact reason why flies do not land on striped animals remains unclear. Temperature regulation as you may know, black or dark colors absorb heat and white color reflects heat. It's theorized that a zebra's black stripe would absorb heat in the morning, whereas white stripes reflect light more and thus help cool the zebras. Predator Protection Additionally, zebra stripes can also confuse predators, as some mammals are colorblind. It can even be more confusing if a herd of zebra, also known as a dazzle, are running in various directions, further confusing its predators. However, if you've ever watched Animal Planet growing up, you'll know that lions still chase and eat zebras for a living. So this theory may be somewhat questionable, but it's interesting to know that confusion could be a possible deterrent to zebra's predators. As a result, answering the question of why zebras have stripes has been tricky, but hey, at least we get to understand its perks. Despite recent efforts, the answer remains unclear. So, stripes might have been designed to address several challenges. They've been shown to guard zebras from biting flies and may have been found to be a critical instrument in a zebra's response to overheating. Interesting zebra facts and life in the wild. Even though the question hasn't really been answered, now we know how crucial and iconic the stripes are for zebras. Now, let us share with you some interesting facts that could potentially contribute to their white and black stripes. Zebras are odd-toed ungulates, mammals with hooves, and hence belong to the Perissodactyla order. Try saying that three times fast. This order is divided into three families, Equidae, horses, donkeys, and zebras, Rhinoceratidae, rhinos, and Tapiridae, tapirs. They are related to horses, but are not the same species. They are both members of the Equidae family and can breed with one another. 
Zebras are found over vast areas within southern and eastern Africa where they prefer to live in treeless grasslands and savanna woods. Because they do not reside in deserts, marshes, or rainforests, they may be sensitive to climate change. There are also three species of zebras that can be found in the wild. Grady Zebra Not Grady, but Grady. The plain zebra, sometimes known as the imperial zebra, is the biggest existing and the most endangered of the three zebra species. It may be found in Kenya and Ethiopia and is named after the former president of France, Jules Grady. Mountain Zebra a southern African zebra species of the Equidae family, the Cape Mountain Zebra is located in South Africa. They get their name from living near mountainous terrain or at mountain slopes. Plains zebra are by far the most widespread. Commonly known as the common zebra, these are the most populous and can be found in southern and eastern Africa south of the Sahara. Can you ride zebras? Although zebras have features that are indeed similar to horses, it is not recommended nor advisable to ride them because it's not practical, since zebras are smaller than horses. Furthermore, zebras have never fully been domesticated, so give them space and privacy and they will do the same to you. However, because of their DNA similarities, zebras and horses can breed with each other. Endangered Species and Communication Another fact is that sadly, they are classified as endangered species. So it's best to help preserve them by making sure they live freely and are not abused. They also communicate through a variety of facial expressions, including wide open eyes and bared teeth. They will also bark, bray, snort, or huff to convey their message. According to the San Diego Zoo, even the position of their ears might indicate their emotions. So there you have it. We hope you enjoyed this video about zebras. We hope to see you again in the next video. Be sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you'll be the first to know when I upload a video. Why do you think zebras have stripes? Let me know in the comments below. Until next time.